come and ride the train come ride it come and ride the train it's the choo choo all right so the first thing i'm gonna do is i got these wood crates and uh you can get them in this non-painted form but i had a couple laying around that i already had painted for a different occasion but we're gonna take and use one two three four uh big crates and then one smaller crate we're gonna drop it down like this and we're gonna paint the first one red as you can see here i have some tin it's just for like uh, hvac tin all right and then um i grab a register vent cover right you can find it in a local uh, hardware store and then another wood crate i'm gonna spray this wood, wood crate green and then we're gonna go and we're gonna spray the register cover gold like that and we're also going to spray our tin gold as well so green gold gold all right so i got the, these things all painted gold but i'm also going to take these led uh, push lights and i'm going to mask off around the actual uh, light itself and then i'm going to spray paint the red gold and there you have it just like that so you got the grate uh you have that tin and you have the tap light all gold allow all that other stuff to dry i'm painting this one white this is a smaller crate than the standard size wood crates you'll find at craft stores and i'm going to go red stripe around the crate two outer sides white so that's what i'm doing right now all right so why the little crate that i showed you that's uh, got the pinstripe red with the white around it and i'm doing that my helper is helping me do the all white crate that we already had white and we're putting a pinstripe basically green and red and then also we spray painted the one other thing gold these are styrofoam okay these are going to be the wheels so if you do do this project you can use wood or styrofoam as i mentioned to you i not only sprayed all of these little uh, styrofoams there's 16 of these right then i'm just using this little piece of foam as a guide because I'm, when i'm all done the center will be gold okay and the outer part is going to be black so i got 16 wheels to do standard like popsicle sticks well these are probably a little more than standard a little bit bigger popsicle sticks as you see here i painted those gold okay this is cardboard and we're, what we're doing is, is we're making the little uh, window frames a few window frames for the train and i'm gonna hot glue that down to the cardboard on that one and then i got this uh, at the dollar store uh the little santa and i'm gonna hot glue it down and then cut out the remaining edges of the cardboard so now what i'm going to do is i, I took the uh grate the heating vent uh cover and the led tap lights which you see are painted gold first things first i'm just going to use an all-purpose uh screw and we're just going to screw down the register grate right into the wood one and then two no hot glue, nothing. Just use these screws so you don't have to worry about it falling off. Once that's done like that, these are self-adhesives. So we're just going to take off the self-adhesive for the train lights. And we're just going to stick it down on there like so. And there's two, you know, one on each side. And covering the hole or the screw. So then, then it would be like that. All right, so uh, once you get the lights on, I grab these little uh, wheels. And I'm installing on each crate, we're going to go ahead and install all of the wheels. Like, you know, I, you can use four screws as there's four holes uh, to do that with. Or you can just use two. I mean, it just depends on how much you're going to plan on rolling it. So get that done on all of the crates. What I'm doing is, after you install the wheels... Just gonna hurry up and get some hot glue down. You're gonna grab your styrofoam painted wheels and you're gonna set them on there, but you don't want them to touch the actual ground because they are fake artificial wheels, they don't spin. And so it should look like this, and you gotta get all of your crates done like so. Some wood screws, fasten that down so then the top um, can't go anywhere. And I'm just gonna set in a few of those wood screws to ensure stability. 
I have this fast in the smaller crate. We're gonna take Santa that we made in the picture window, basically, and we're gonna hot glue that down like so. What you're gonna do is, you're gonna take that uh, other uh, window frame you made, you're gonna stick it on the other flat side of a small crate, and then you're gonna take your tin right here, and you're gonna hot glue that down, and of course hot glue down your picture as well. All right, so as you can see, I bought a lot of decorations for each uh, train cart from the dollar store, the Dollar Tree, Dollar Store, wherever you want to get them. So I got this from there, and I'm just kind of dazzling them up a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and show it to you in the dark. There's the front end with the tap lights on there, all right? And we're going to come around. All right. Slowly show it to you, each cart. All right, just have fun with it. And then now you can see what it looks like during the day. Now what you're gonna notice is, I didn't show you this, but you're gonna have to go to the hardware store. We'll grab some hooks right there and some chain link. You can get it at a local hardware store and you just screw them on in. And as you can see, each one is screwed in to each of the carts. Okay, and then we just did all these holiday decorations. All of the decorations you see are from the dollar store, even the little lights, and then also the tree. And we individually bought these from the dollar store, the little balls and, and the little Christmas uh, uh, thing. All that's from the dollar store, except for the snow. I got that elsewhere. All right, the fluff. So there you guys have it. Hope you like the train. Come and ride the train. Remember, it's the... Choo-choo.